Hi guys. Mm -hmm. Hey Siti, you look so occupied. What's bothering you? I don't understand. Mr. Chu keep complaining that he's having pain here, he's having pain there, pain everywhere. And it's only at night. But in the day, he's fine. It starts around like about 10 plus at night. And he starts to complain, missy missy, pain pain. I don't know how I can help him. Siti, did you ask him which part of his body experiences this pain? And what kind of pain is it? Is it a very sharp pain? Or does it come intermittently? And how frequent is this pain? I've asked, but he keep on pointing to his leg and said, pain, pain. Siti, have you heard about this acronym, Old Cuts to Assess Pain? What's Old Cuts? I only know Old Maid, Old McDonald's. <laughs> it's the first time I'm hearing Old Cuts. What a coincidence. I bet you haven't seen the latest update at the well. This week's topic is about pain assessment. When a client experiences pain, we need to assess the type and nature of the pain before giving appropriate treatment. Alice was right, you know, earlier to ask you where the pain is located. Is the pain sharp or dull? What would make the pain worse, etc. There are certain information that is critical in making an assessment. Having some keywords will help us to remember the type of information together. It's called mnemonics. Like old cuts, for example. Sounds random, right? But it reminds us some of the key areas to look out for. Old cuts means onset, location, duration, character, aggravating factors, relieving factors, timing and severity. But what do these words mean? Uh -huh. Onset means when the pain started. For location means where is the pain located. For D is duration. Is the pain persistent? And character, how does it feel like? What are the characteristics of the pain? Aggravating factors, that's A. How can it be worse? And R, relieving factors, what makes it better? T is for timing, is it constant? How often it comes and goes? And severity, how bothersome or painful is the pain? Wow, this mnemonic thingy is amazing. I will use this the next time Mr. Chu complained about having pain. Thank you, brother. It's awesome. Hey, but Maru, mm. what is this? Mnemonics, uh, I keep hearing the word. Well, mnemonics are methods to help in remembering the facts and the structure of information. Okay, It can use acronyms, words, pictures, rhythms, tunes or things to help us in remembering. Let's see, what do you see here? Uh, communication board? Um, information? I know, I know. Um, is the well. You see, it's W E L L, it's an acronym, right? It's about wholesome, enriching, lifelong learning. Oh, now I see. <laughs> well, well done, Siti. You learn very fast. The purpose of the well is to motivate us to learn continuously. The picture of the well, yeah, it signifies that learning runs deep and it takes effort to draw the water and drink from it. <laughs> <laughs> Have you taken a sip? You bet. <laughs> uh, that's good. So you see?